outspoken and bold and courageous. I love the fact that he defends life. I love the fact that he believes and loves God. I love the fact that he holds himself humbled to God. No. And we've seen, uh, I mean, President Trump has now put up for confirmation. Amy Coney Barrett, who is also a very devout woman with, I mean, seven children of, right. of her own, which is very beautiful. I just want to get your just reaction, your response to her being put up for the Supreme Court. Oh, I think she's fantastic. She happens to be a good friend of our colleague, Paolo Grotza. He's a Notre Dame professor up there, and they're colleagues. Um, she's commendable. She's humble. She's from the Midwest. I'm from the Midwest. I'm from the Midwest. I love her virtues, her Catholicism reigns through in every part of her life. I am so thrilled that she's an originalist. The medical professionals, the doctors, the nurses, everybody at Walter Reed Medical Center. I think it's the finest in the world for the incredible job they've been doing. Uh, I came here, wasn't feeling so well. I feel much better now. We're working hard to get me all the way back. I have to be back because we still have to make America great again. We've done an awfully good job of that, but we still have steps to go and we have to finish that job. And I'll be back. I think I'll be back soon. And I look forward to finishing up the campaign the way it was started and the way we've been doing, the kind of numbers that we've been doing. We've been so proud of it. But this was something that happened, and it's happened to millions of people all over the world. Guys, we're honored to have Jack Pasovic here oh, with us today. Like, Jack. Boy, this, I, I tell you something, I, I, you know, we got so much 2016 level energy out here. It only makes sense that Right Side, RSBN, would be here. Right Side, you know, you guys have been here from the absolute start of this movement. I remember being out there, going to those rallies in, in 2016 during the primaries. You know, what people didn't know, and it was always RSBN because back in the day, you know, it, there weren't that many people who were on the Trump train. It really was RSBN that I think that was how, you know, they kind of, the network really made their name. And it's, you know, it's just so great seeing uh, how you guys have blossomed up. Of course, we've, you know, also come along and, and really come out there. I'm just trying to keep an eye on what's going on behind us. So I, I think people did, I don't know if they explained the situation, but there is a suspicious package that was left outside the very, uh, the main entrance there to Walter to read uh, so the Secret Service as well as all the local authorities are of course investigating they're making sure everybody's safe uh, there was somebody who came by he said that he thought that it was it was he had kind of claimed it and says look I was just being dumb and I, I forgot it here but you know look obviously under these circumstances given the situation they're not taking any chances so they're doing their job they're keeping everybody safe they're keeping everybody out here safe they're keeping everybody inside safe and you know you just gotta you gotta respect that and you gotta go along with that yeah 